I'm the movie geek. <laughs> I'm not going to sing. Hello, I'm the movie geek, and we are doing our 31 films in 31 days. Halloween countdown is getting close now. 27th, day 27, film 27, Psycho. Sorry. Yeah, alright. <laughs> <laughs> What can be said about this film, right? It's Alfred Hitchcock. It changed film in good ways. <laughs> it's hard to, I'd, I'd love to do a proper like breakdown and, and proper analysis of it because, but, but everyone's done it. Everyone's done it. And there's really no point for me to do it. What can I bring to the table that's not, you know, new that he, it's the first ever flushing toilet on, on screen. Yeah. Yeah. It's a bit of a random fact. Yeah, yeah no. <laughs> And it's just such a good film. And you can't, and I can't wait for my boys to grow up so I can show it them because I think, I remember when I first saw it, I, um, I, I said to my parents I was watching this black and white film and we found out it was Psycho and they said, well, keep watching and we won't disturb you and they let me watch it <laughs> and I was only, I was young mm -hmm. and I watched it and I was like, I think I asked them, I said, well, why, why is the mother doing, why is she killing the, this, why is she killed this woman and this man mm -hmm. and they were like, just keep watching and at the end I was like, <gasps> what? <laughs> and it's like, I think the only problem with the film is the, the analysis at the end, the the exposition, uh, exposition dump, but I think that need, that you know is needed in the film because of, of viewers who don't understand what <laughs> the the problem is. Mm. But it's it's I loved it. I thought it was great. You not so much. Um, <laughs> I love Hitchcock. I always have loved Alfred Hitchcock. I used to love Alfred Hitchcock's Presents. Yeah. If you remember that, viewers? Um, I do like Psycho. I don't think you can not like it. Um, it's just, I think it's now becoming kind of, it's the sort of film that people won't watch anymore, especially like newer generations of people. Unless you're a proper film boss and you're really into films, I don't think kids would sit and watch it now. Hmm. Um, I did. We used to watch Psycho. We watched The Birds. We watched, you know, we, Rope. Yeah, Rope was one of my favourite strangers on the Rear train. Rear Window Vertigo. Rear Window is one of my favourite films of all yeah. times. Um, Jimmy Stewart version, obviously. Um, I do like Psycho. I think Anthony Perkins. Oh, was good, cool, wasn't he? Is very, very good in it. Um, and the way you know the the famous line, we all go a little crazy sometimes. And it's my favourite scene. That it's. It's, it's probably quite shocking of its time that he was dressing up as his dead mother. Yeah. Um, because there was quite a, quite a taboo and things. Well, he says at the end, don't he? But he says, oh, it's a transvestite. Yeah. Um, but he's more than that. Yeah, he's, well, he used to do you know, the voyeurism, the watching of people. Yeah. And it's all quite disturbing, and you think <laughs> you put yourself, it is creepy because if you run, you know, you're in a motel. In the middle of Norway, you're really tired. There's a guy and his <laughs> mum, and you think it's funny. I wouldn't be safe. Um, it it is good. I don't, like I said, you can't not like Psycho. No. I just, I don't know. I do think kids, younger kids now, worn. It's not the sort of thing that they will watch. Hmm? I don't know. I don't know. I, don't I suppose think it might be wrong. Yeah. Uh, well, well, we'll 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 see what we'll judge it when we show. Uh, Kids. Yeah, I, that's what I mean. I'm sort of basing it on what I think and all and no, be like, what's this? It's boring. It's black and white. Just watch it, kid. Yeah. I don't or, you know. can, or you can watch the colour remake. I mean, if it came on now, if it was on one of the nights, I wouldn't sit and watch it now. Uh, I, I have. Yeah. I have. I have. I've, cause I've, I've seen it a few times. Really. I know. I suppose it it's is got, one of those films. The, the, the newer right. versions is like the, you know, the, the sequels and things. Oh, the sequels. When he's older and he poisons his real mother. And but the second one isn't too bad it's uh, it's as good as a follow-on as, yeah. as it could be yeah they're falling down the stairs the way some of the stuff yeah, is filmed is, is great, brilliant yeah, yeah. Um, and like 
we were saying the other night, um, we were talking about Tippi Hedron before we watched it. Because of everything said, that's happened. Yeah, she was talking about um, She came Weinstein, out, didn't she? Yeah. And you'd said about she was a really famous star at the time and a bit like Drew Barrymore was screaming at the review yesterday. Yeah. She, the way she was killed off instantly and he was like, wow, this, this... Well, people would have gone to the cinemas to see yeah, her. Yeah, to see her. And it's like, wow, this doesn't... It's a bit like Samuel L. Jackson in Deep Blue Sea. <laughs> it just came from nowhere. It's like, how has this happened? This is the yeah. only reason I'm watching this film. <laughs> um, and it's... Um, and it is, you know, the word iconic and stuff is used a lot, but it's iconic. It's it iconic. Is, yeah. the, the shower scene, nothing like that had ever been filmed before, had it, no. they'd used... And they used the... Um, what is it they use? They, it's so you can eat it for blood. Corn syrup. Corn syrup. Yeah. We should know from the screen review, yeah. really. I know. Corn syrup. Corn syrup. <laughs> oh, yeah. Psycho. Because he says that as well. He I've says, got baby brain. Whatever. Um, no, yeah. It is. It's good. And mm. it's very... It's graphic without being... Yes. Graphic. Recuitous. Yeah. Yeah, it's... Um, That's what, my point about like the remake. The... the oh. The awful Vince Vaughn. Vince Vaughn, Gus Van Sant. He, it was a shot for shot remake. It's literally shot for shot, except they decided to add a few extra things. Mm. With Vince Vaughn looking through the the hole, but he's masturbating, mm. and it's like it's not needed. You don't need it. Yeah. He's looking through, and oh, you, he, mm, it annoys me. It just annoys me that it got made. It's Vince Vaughn's. It's nice. Yeah, he just should be in a studio. No, no, we've seen no in um, that Mel Gibson film recently. Uh, Ridge, Ridge, back. I don't know what's it called. Oh, Hacksaw Ridge. Yeah, Hacksaw yeah, Ridge. He was, right he, was he was good in that. He has yeah. um, the uh, drama chops. <laughs> I don't know, but it it just awful. Yeah, I don't. And I'm Hesh not, as well. Yeah, oh, she's awful in anything. But it, it just, it's not needed. No. It wasn't needed. Well, Psycho is Anthony Perkins, isn't it? Yeah. It's the way he looks, his colour, even like his hair colour and his eye colour. Yeah. Very dark. Yeah, very dark. And yeah. Pale skin and he's classic. He's perfect. Because yeah. the, the, my favourite scene is the, the parlour scene and the way they're just having a chat. She's just eating and he laughs and he says that you eat like a bird. And she, you know, because of all the stuff all the stuff birds. birds. But then the talk goes to the mother, and and you see him, and it, he's relaxed like that, and then he then he sits up, and just his body language is so perfect, and as well you can see him change from from Norman to his mother, mm. and when he's Norman, he's very open, and he's even caressing a bird, which is. And he's in with a woman, and it, that's his lust coming out, and I, it's just perfect. And then it's weird because you don't have a clue because even when he's having a conversation yeah. with his mother, yeah. the yeah. first time you watch it and you're like, "Gosh, he's a right pain in the ass," and you realise, "Oh my God, it was him. He was on the street. He was talking to himself." Yeah. It's just, it's so good. It is, it is good. I'm, I'm gonna give it an A plus. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That it's an it has to be it can't not be. I'm gonna give it a B plus. Double um, negatives. Um, I'm gonna give it a B plus. Um, I think just because uh, I don't know. Is that, I think it's it's aged. I worry for it, and I wouldn't mm. necessarily watch it again. I think it's one of them. If you visit it too many times, you probably get well, sick yeah. of it. And I've seen it a few times, so well, maybe. That's the problem though with those sort of films where it has a massive twist at the end you can only really watch it twice once for the initial shock and then second time to check everything yeah, and, and see like see oh hang on yeah i missed that before and now i understand why that's there yeah but other than that you you can only either watch it for nostalgic purposes but yeah yeah and like i say i'm gonna it's it's like uh, empire strikes back as well showing the boys would be perfect if it wasn't so well known who Darth Vader is. Yeah. And it's it's difficult to to be innocent and un uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, something oh, I don't know, I'm losing my words. <laughs> Not knowing. Not, Not knowing. knowing what's yeah. Going. You just Yeah. Oh, I don't know, I'll leave it at that. 
like I say, I could talk about it all night. I'd, I'd love to like proper put it down into words and and do a real. I don't know. <laughs> so not, I don't know, yeah. analysis. Analysis of it, yeah. B plus for me. A plus for me. Good A plus. <laughs> okay. All right. We'll see you later. Bye. What day are we on? You just yeah. said before. Okay. Bye. Bye. You upload if that's how cool of you. Sure.